Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Adam Schiff crosses red line, goes after all Trump spanks like a two-bit gangster. Adam Schiff just went full gangster and crossed all of President Trump's red lines at once. Look, Mueller came up empty, so what does Schiff think he will find? That Trump is wealthy and like all rich guys, he has a complicated series of investments, properties, stocks, etc. This is a new low for Adam and his crew of conspiracy theorists masquerading as the Democratic Party. From Politico, House Democrats on Monday issued a subpoena to the German lender Deutsche Bank seeking information on President Donald Trump's finances, a major escalation of their investigation into his business dealings. In addition to the Deutsche Bank subpoena, House Democrats subpoenaed other banks, including J.P. Morgan Chase, Bank of America and Citigroup, seeking information on Russian money laundering. The issuance of the subpoenas was first reported by The New York Times. The House Intelligence and Financial Services Committees are ratcheting up their coordinated investigations into Trump's business dealings as the Justice Department prepares to release findings from special counsel Robert Mueller's probe on Thursday. As part of our oversight authority and authorized investigation into allegations of potential foreign influence on the U.S. political process, the House Intelligence Committee today issued subpoenas to multiple financial institutions in coordination with the House Financial Services Committee, including a friendly subpoena to Deutsche Bank, which has been cooperative with the committees, said Rep. Adam Schiff, Democrat California, the House Intelligence Chairman. We look forward to their continued cooperation and compliance. Rep. Maxine Waters, Democrat California, chairwoman of the Financial Services Committee, said in a statement that the potential use of the U.S. financial system for illicit purposes was a very serious concern. The Financial Services Committee is exploring these matters, including as they may involve the president and his associates, as thoroughly as possible pursuant to its oversight authority, and will follow the facts wherever they may lead us, she said. From Reuters, House Intelligence Committee Chairman Adam Schiff said in a statement the subpoenas issued included a friendly subpoena to Deutsche Bank. A 2018 financial disclosure form showed liabilities for Trump of at least $130 million to Deutsche Bank Trust Company Americas, a unit of the German bank. They are for properties including the Trump International Hotel and a former post office in Washington. Deutsche Bank said in January, shortly after Democrats took control of the House following the November elections, that it had received an inquiry from the two committees on its ties to the Republican president. Schiff said Deutsche Bank had been cooperative. We look forward to their continued cooperation and compliance, he said. Carrie McHugh, a Deutsche Bank spokeswoman, said the bank was engaged in a productive dialogue with the two committees. We remain committed to providing appropriate information to all authorized investigations in a manner consistent with our legal obligations, she said in an emailed statement. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.